Solid Edge ST6 delivers more than a thousand new enhancements. First of all, we have a really good focus on synchronous technology. Got some great enhancements in the patterning, thousands of features going very quickly, the ability to recognize those coming from other CAD systems. Of course, surfacing has been a strong area for Solid Edge, but we've made it a lot stronger. And then finally, we've had a, a big investment in sheet metal. We want to take that to the next level. So when you're creating a, a deep drawn part or a stamped sheet metal part, it's often easier to kind of design the tool that's going to produce the shape. And so you can use all the different methods in Solid Edge to do that and then you can push that into the sheet metal and deform the sheet metal into that shape. And then of course, since you created the tool, you got a great start on your tooling as well. And it's all associative together, so if you change your tooling, then the part will change as well. We've had 2D goal seek for quite some time. We've extended that to 3D, so you could optimize or goal seek for mass or volume, those kind of things in 3D. So suppose you have a sheet metal bracket, it's a certain thickness, and you need to only have a certain deformation under load. You can't exceed a certain amount. You're trying to make the material thinner, but you don't know how much thinner you can go and still only deflect that certain amount. Optimize will figure out that for you. With very few iterations, you'll have the design complete. We've been working with SharePoint for a very long time. It's a great way to interact with your data. And what we've tried to do is make it a more visual process. Preview more clearly, have thumbnails in the relation browser, those kind of things. So you can graphically view the content of a project and we have customizable formula lists, so you only see the information that's relevant under that thumbnail. We've also improved searching quite a bit, so during file open you can, for example, search based on part numbers or titles, properties, really anything you'd like to. So a lot of people are coming to Solid Edge just because it's faster, design faster, do revisions faster, those kind of things. Maybe they're concerned about the direction of their current CAD system, or they're not getting the productivity they like out of that CAD system. And so we have in place now bulk migrators that allow you to take whole folders of all your stuff, the assemblies, parts, drawings, bring all that stuff over in one shot. And we've extended it in the case of the SolidWorks migrator. You can actually bring over a lot more than just the parts, assemblies, and drawings. You're bringing over a lot of intelligence whether that's materials or threads, assembly constraints, configurations, all the things that you had there in your SolidWorks file, a lot of that's going to be brought over to Solid Edge automatically. And then once it's in Solid Edge, you can interact with it very intuitively using synchronous technology. And we've also built a lot of learning tools for users who are coming from other systems. We have a lot of videos that are, are specifically targeted to users of other systems. They can learn Solid Edge very quickly. Of course, another thing is you want it to be a familiar environment. And so we've put in place themes where you can customize your environment in Solid Edge automatically to look a lot like your prior CAD system. Well, it's all about designing better. We have accelerated design processes so you're able to bring products to market more quickly. And of course, it's about reducing costs as well. So we're talking about faster revisions and better data reuse that allow you to bring your costs down. So with ST6, there's never been a better time to start designing better with Solid Edge.